Dede, you're huge into drawing. What is it about that that just like kind of makes you want to draw so much and does it help you kind of detach from baseball? Uh, for me, drawing, it's more like a re relaxation for me when I got nothing else to do besides think about baseball. <laughs> but yeah, for me, it's uh, just time to myself, you know, uh, trying to get a little bit creative, you know, free the mind a little bit and uh, try and draw something, something fun. And what would you say is your favorite thing to draw? Because you've drawn so many different types of things, whether yeah. it's one of your own tattoos or... <laughs> uh, well, I'm trying to get better at uh, photorealistic. Mm -hmm. So I'm trying to, trying to get that realism thing down and trying to get that going. And just, just like action, like sports kind of like stuff. So kind of like that. Do you enjoy taking photos yourself, on whether it's on your cell phone or, for instance, your brother, who's a photographer, mm -hmm. taking one of your guys' photos and drawing it? Uh, yeah, I do that actually. I do that a lot. I, most of my drawings are like that too, so uh, I don't mind doing that, mm -hmm. no, not at all. And you got a little taste of the spray paint also. How did that go? <laughs> uh, well, uh, I was looking at some uh, drawing tutorials on, uh, on YouTube and I saw that spray painting. I was like, this looks like really easy. And then that's how I went and then I found the biggest table I had in, uh, in the backyard and I just spray painted until today it's still standing there. So. It's, uh, it was fun. It was fun for me. Do you like to hang up a lot of your own artwork throughout your apartment or house? Uh, I do it at my house back home, yeah. I started hanging them and uh, spray painting a couple too and hanging them too. So, you know, trying to get a little collection going. And the Derek Jeter photo, where is that? That's in my <laughs> sketchbook. And that got a lot of attention. So you drew that before even getting here? Yes, I drew that last year, October, I think it was. October, September, somewhere around there. So. And and then I ended up being all over, all over the media and all that stuff when I got traded here too. So yeah, I was gonna say back yeah. then you had no idea that you're actually gonna come to New York and no, for uh, for that to happen yeah. is pretty <laughs> uh, pretty wild. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> What's your favorite part about drawing, like specifically? Is it the detachment? Is it being able to be that creative? Uh, I think it's more, it's like free to mind. Like it's just, it just get a blank paper or whatever and just try to draw something, you know. So it's like get creative, be relaxed. Because if you're tense, I don't think you can draw. You'll be frustrated. But you know, if more relaxed you are, I think the better I got at painting too, and drawing all that stuff. So for me, that's that's what's been working for me. Just relax and just sketch something up. You grew up with drawing. And you also grew up with soccer. Yeah. Uh, you, a couple of the other major league baseball players like Jonathan Scope, Andre Alton Simmons. Uh, all you guys are big time soccer players. Yeah. Did you ever think about taking that route? Uh, no, <laughs> no, no, never, never, no. But would you have to say you're probably the best out of all of them? No, they are, they are better than me. They're way better than me. <laughs> I got some skills, but they got more skills. So mm -hmm. yeah, they're better than me in that. And you said that if you weren't playing baseball, you'd like to become a doctor. Yeah. Um, so I guess soccer was probably never in the picture, even though you'd like uh, to do it a lot because in the Netherlands they play it. Yeah, but for me, it's just something to do on the side. It's just something for fun. So it was kind of cool.